Hi, I'm Rob and it's monthly mythic time and the new mythic available today or this week is Pharaoh Kafru. I've already checked the guild chat, made sure people are getting it, made sure it's not bugged, like don't want to go spending a load of keys and you don't get it, for example, that would be particularly annoying. So let's crack open a few chests. Right, guild chests are first on the menu. Let's bust open a few of these chests, see how lucky we get. Let us know in the comments if you got this nice and early or it took a while. I've had kind of moderate luck on these lately. I've had a really bad run for a little while. It's been not too bad. Let's uh, see what happens today though. Kind of interesting sounding mythic. Should we get it? Presuming we do get it of course we'll crack it op crack open and make a team on it later on. Woke up late today. So if I sound a bit tired, that's why, because I've got up kind of late. It's actually nearly 10 o'clock here, 10 a.m. <laughs> that's quite late for me. Considering it's a, could be a multi-video day, usually get up earlier than that on those multi-video days, but I kind of wake up when I wake up, I don't kind of set an alarm and stuff like that. Hmm, burning through these quite quickly. Yeah, one. Stop hiding in the sand, Mr. Pharaoh Face, whatever your name is. Ah, see, I told him to stop hiding and he done a blow off or something and then just um, saw a little puff of sand. So I knew where he was hiding and he had no, no choice but to reveal himself. Right, but that's one of them. But ideally, I want more than one because I think this is going to be absolutely fantastic with two, maybe even three. And the reason I say that is because if you haven't seen the, the traits on this thing yet... Oh, there's a second one. Fantastic. Let's just uh, show that better. Explode two random gems when my turn begins. This is fantastic. I love the idea of this. I think three of these is going to be absolutely just ridiculous. I think if you have three of these, it's just you put a weapon at the top that does damage to all, and you'll just get it charged up almost straight away, especially in a 50% mana start class. Got to experiment on that. This is just a theory at the moment. But let's see if we can get get another one. Hopefully it's not going to be too stingy on the third one. It's like a... The second one came nice and quick. That was really cool. Looks like I'm about to run out of these though. Have I still got some... Orbs to open. Let's just use the last remaining dribblets of these. Alright, so let us let's just see if we get lucky with glory chests, I doubt it. Very low chance with glory chests. See some people in the comments sometimes saying, Oh, we opened, you know, however many twenty thousand glory chest whatever and I've got nothing <clears throat> the game's a rip off and blah 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 it's not the chance of getting one from a glory chest is just super super low like really low like uh, a glory chest the mythic 0.01% that's why I, I do, undo these ones first because the, the chance is the best like 0.11 apart from VIP keys so let us shall I carry on with these I don't think I've ever got a monthly mythic from the glory chest before right let's just uh it would be lucky if i got them from this but i want to see what happens at the same time i'm committed now aren't i may as well keep on going got two but i do want my third one Like I say, three of these in a team with any damage to all weapon at the top. Or another weapon. I'm only thinking damage to all at the moment. It may be another way around it. Oh, I'm into the glory now. Don't do that. Right, let's jump into the gem chests. 
Right, 50 a time. I'm not going to go 200. I don't want to bust open too many in one go. In fact, I don't think I've ever got like more than one at a time. See, some people sometimes they say they got two or three in a single bunch of openings of chests, and it's like I've literally don't think I've ever ever had that. Oh, this word, third one's being a bit el elusive. Maybe it needs to eat some starchy food and blow off in the sand like the other one did. That's how I found the first one. And the second one got revealed pretty quickly as well. But this third one is... Right now, costing an absolute fortune. Hmm. To persevere or not to persevere? This is the question. Right. We got it. So, there's the third one. Now, we do have three of these, so with three of these in the team, you're going to be exploding six gems when my turn begins. So as soon as the game starts, you'll be exploding six gems. And my theory is, this is just a theory till we try it a little bit later on, with any weapon that does a damage to all, like the Ruby Macaque, things like that. Now, just find a bunch of weapons. I mean, any of these on a 50% mana start team, you'll pick up mana really, really quickly. Let's type in scatter. Because scatter damage is pretty good for this kind of thing as well. Scatter damage when you're using purple. Obviously, the more colours something uses, then the better. It, ooh. But that should charge up straight away. Imperial Jewel and three of, of that new troop, because it explodes six gems and this uses all colours and this does scatter damage, that should charge up straight away and just wipe out early levels on Explore in a just single cast. It'll just be start the game, explode gems, cast that. That should work. And especially in a 50% mana start as well. Like Geomancer, Archer, things like that. Guaranteed, but I think I might get it anyway. You could start with a Medal of Arnu, of course. As well as that, like troops like Dom and Tina that use all the colours as well that do high damage to all. That's going to be very, very good with that as well. There's a good chance that might charge that up in one go as well. And also, obviously, Stellarix as well. That'd be pretty decent as well. Let's find the old Stellar face. Yep, yeah, all the colours. Lots of damage to all. Yeah, this troop is going to be really, really good with these kind of uh, troops here. Exploding six gems from the start of the game. Really, really cool. Right, so I'll be looking at this later on with Stellarix, with Diamond Tina, with Imperial Jewel. It's going to be a fun new mythic, this one. Let me know what you think of this new mythic in the comments. I think it's a pretty cool one. If you think how well-regarded Possessed King is, just because of that unstable possession... That third trait that's got, and this is on a different level to that because it just explodes two gems every turn. So really, really cool. So um, yes, let me know what you think of this in the comments and did you get it cheaply or expensive? And I'll catch you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.